Hey YouTube, this is Dak13, and in this video I'll be showing you how to get a really awesome tweak for your iPhone, iPod Touch, or iPad called Locktopus. Now basically what this enables you to do is you can lock all any of like you can lock any of your apps with a password on your home screen um, simply by just holding down one of them and pressing the like a small lock button comes up in the lower right hand corner of every app and you can press that and it will lock it and you can change the default password for every application and settings and what's cool about this is like other password locking applications to lock um, apps you don't need to respring reboot or anything it's real simple and really easy to do but before we get on to the tutorial I just want to say a few things first off Please subscribe to my new second YouTube channel called Other to Hacker 13. You should see some text appearing on the screen right now showing you the link to my second YouTube channel. So remember just to go to that link and the link will be at the very top of the description and I'll redirect you to my second YouTube channel. It's called Other to Hacker 13. But anyways, go there and click subscribe. Now, second, you should see some new text on the screen showing you my Twitter account. So make sure to please follow me on Twitter. I'll have a link in the description down below. So just go to my Twitter account and hit follow. So remember, if you enjoy the video, please thumbs up, leave a comment down below, and also subscribe. And now let's get on to the tutorial. Alright guys, so the first thing you want to do is open up Cydia, and you want everything to load up in Cydia. And you will need to add a source, and that source will be in the description down below, but it will also be, there will also be some text on the screen in about 10 seconds showing you the source, and you can just pause the video and type it in as you see it. So just let everything load, and I'll be right back as soon as it downloads all the packages and loads everything it needs to. Alright, so once everything has loaded, you can simply touch Manage, touch Sources, press Edit, and then press Add. And you want to type in the source that is on the screen right now. So currently you cannot see the video or my iPod. You just see a blank black screen with some text on it. And that white text is the source that you need to type in. So take this time now during the video. Um, just to type it in and now you should see my device again but anyways type it in and press add source which is right there so the source is apt.p2pworlds.co.uk and in case you weren't be able in case you weren't in case you weren't be able, weren't able to sorry about that in case you weren't able to type it in while I said it or while it was on the screen remember that the source will be always down below in the description and you can just add it from there. So once you have the source added to your iDevice, you can go to search right at the right hand bottom of the screen and you want to touch the search bar and you want to search Locto. L-O-C-K-T-O. -O. And you should see something called Loctopus from the source you just added, the P2P World repo. So you want to touch it and you want to press install. I've already installed it, but you just want to press install and then it should restart your springboard. So as you can see, here's my device here. Now this is basically a demonstration. I'll hold down settings and as you can see, there is a new thing in the lower left hand corner, like I already said, with a small lock. So you can press the lock and it will lock it. Now with the default password, it the default password is password, like those word that word password. So now whenever I open up photos, I also have to type in password, and it launch. And if it's right, it will allow me to do it. Now to unlock it, you just select the application and you press the unlock button, and you have to retype the password. and it unlock and it will unlock it now to change the password you want to open up settings and you scroll down and you should see Loctopus 
You press it and you can change the master password. You type in the old password, which is, like I already said, password. And I'll change it to, to Hacker13. And hit accept. Your password is now to Hacker13. So now when I change it, I can lock an application, and that is a new password. Thanks for watching, guys. Like I said at the very beginning of this video, if it worked for you, remember to thumbs up, leave a comment down below, and also please subscribe. And like I said before, please subscribe to my new second YouTube channel called Other to Hacker 13, and follow me on Twitter. Thanks for watching, guys, and see you all later.